swim lessons. Let's get the water out of here. Hey, YouTube. We're in uh, Smithtown here, and uh, we figured we'd take you by one of those uh, big things again. Now you can pull up a little further. Yeah, the crazies are starting to come out. But, uh, this is downtown Main Street, Smithtown, very old town, town hall. And, uh, figured we'd take it by one of those big things again. It's, uh, one of the bulls. Actually, it's a bull, a statue of a bull. The legend has it that, uh, got the gentleman's name, but, uh, 1660, the, uh, saved the life of an Indian's chief, an Indian's chief's daughter, and he said he, he can keep the prop, the amount of property that you can ride in one day on the, on a bull. And, uh, that's the story behind the Spittown Bowl. We rode, rode the bowl in one big circle in one day. And we'd be able to keep the property. Ouch. that or not, but the boat lights, it is like straight ahead. That's the Smithtown bow right there. I don't know if you can see it or not. I'm going to pull up a little closer. The visor's starting to fog up. That's a Smithtown bowl. Oh, established in 1665. He's uh, 10 feet tall and 12 feet tall. And about 15 feet long. Or maybe a little longer than that. Hey, cuttlefish. This one's for you, man. The Goodyear blimp. Don't know which one it is. But hey, cuttlefish, this one's for you, man. 192 feet long. I did. I looked it up this morning, so I can cheat. <laughs> it's 192 feet long. 52 feet high. And top speed of uh, 14 miles an hour. Oh, the wind's grabbing it and pushing it. Usually the name is right on the tail section there, so wind's pushing it around, so I can't see the name of it. I think they only have three of them. I don't even see the chase vehicles. Or the support team. Oh, yeah. It's one for you, eight cuttlefish. Another thing to add to our uh, the big thing videos. Now it's pushing it back around. <laughs> Unreal. It's cool how they have this set up, especially since. Uh, just saw the special on um, the Hindenburg. But this is another one for our the big things. 
I don't know why the hell these blimps are coming around here so often. Hey guys, Airline 750 here once again. I'm on the uh, search for number three of big things. And uh, it's kind of getting late in the day. It's only about 8.30 and the uh, lunatics are starting to come out all over the place. And, uh, and number three isn't too far away. It's right up the road here by the intersection. Gotta go through a uh, small industrial court uh, complex. Hope it's still there. And new people moved into the building, so uh, they may have taken it down, which would be a shame if they did, but yeah, I think they did. Yeah, they did. It was a uh, big, gigantic Buddha. Uh, the thing must have been at least 15 feet tall. It was huge. And the, uh, I think the, uh, the uh, previous owners of the building were uh, Chinese, Japanese, one of the two. Some Asian group. Yeah, this Buddha, <laughs> it was huge. Oh, well, so I guess we don't have a uh, number three. We're just gonna have to stick with the uh, the blimp and the bowl. I'm not trying to give you any bowl, but yeah. Ha 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 ha. It's strange that they took the the uh, Buddha away. Oh. Well. well, let's see if we can get home without having anybody kill us. We're only about uh, three miles away. But such is life. Got a lot of stuff to do today. Got to take out the free filter of my wife's wonderful washing machine. To clean that out. $1,300 washing machine, you think it can do it by itself? No. Then we gotta go food shopping. I gotta take out dog food for my greyhound puppies. Our club had a, uh, a fall ball party yesterday. The rescue, uh, rescue and greyhounds, and um, yeah, what you call 50-50. You know, you get 50% of the pot that uh, that's collected, and uh, we raised up uh, almost eleven thousand dollars, and um, just one person ended up winning it, which she was going to walk away with a little more than five thousand dollars. And, um, instead of taking the money, she just gave it back to the club, which is really cool. Because that's, that lets us go out and buy, um, more dog food. Transportation costs for getting the dogs up here. Um, you know, vet bills. I mean, the vet gives us discounts, but, um, you know, we still have the, uh, vet bills to contend with. And then I cheat. Uh, that's really cool. He just turned around, gave the money right back to him. So, that was one neat thing. Oh, here's our sub fire department. Ain't that cool? Have the parking lot repaved like they needed it. More ways of wasting money. This is my neighborhood, as if you haven't seen it before. We 
for some of you that haven't, this is it. Sorry to have bored you, if I have, right into my neighborhood here. So, anyway. want to tell uh say one thing uh mike alley come on man get back to it sorry about your dad but we out here would like to see and hear from you if that would be okay michael i know you're a very busy person michael but you started something with us and we would like for you to finish or continue not finish just continue you started a cool thing a really great person now we want more of you Michael come on Michael let's get back into it okay babe You the man. Come on. Hey, all right, dudes. Coming up on the crib here. This is my crib over here. If we catch it later. Hope the wife ain't up yet. I'll see you soon. Bye.